Hey, let me show you five quick tips to your camera on the Samsung Galaxy A55 5G. So first of all, uh, let's start from the zoom feature. If you often use zoom like this, I can show you how you can use it a little bit better. So go into the settings in the left upper corner, just click on the settings icon. Then from this, you have to scroll down and you have to move into the shutting methods. Now select press volume buttons too and select zoom in or zoom out and take a look how great it works. Now when you click and hold the volume up button, you can smoothly zoom in and smoothly zoom out. You don't need to use your two fingers and pinch the screen and leave the fingerprints on it. You can just do this one by one. Take a look. You can just click on it and you can zoom in really, really close, really close and really smooth. Next, if you are taking the photos and you had this brightness issue, for example, the lighting conditions are not the best, just click on the screen and by using this icon, you can actually increase or decrease brightness level manually. You can also do this automatically by clicking here. Next, if you want to get more, if you want to get photos with the more details, for sure you can do this by selecting 50 megapixel mode. Now hold your phone steady, take the photo, and take a look how many details we can actually get, and take a look how close we can actually zoom in. So this is a really great feature. Next option that is pretty useful, uh, it will be definitely to take the photos by using the palm of our hand. So go to the selfie camera, now show the palm of your hand, and you can just take the selfie. And when you want to take these photos without showing your hand, without touching the phone, you can use the voice comments. So if you say, for example, smile, smile, as you can see, the photo was taken. You can also record videos by saying record video. There we go. That's pretty cool. And the last option, this is actually available in the more modes. You can go into the pro and from this, you can actually adjust every parameter of the photo that you want manually. So for example, you can find the shutter speed, exposure compensation, or for example, the white balance. And if you select any of this function, you can click on this information icon where you will, where you will actually find description of every parameter. So this is it. Right now, please subscribe to my channel and see you in the next one.